Hi guys, Michael Jensen here. You know, most fish love shrimp flies. And the polar shrimp is a classic steelhead fly that will catch most anything with fins. Uh, it's tied in a lot of different variations. Today we're gonna tie my take on this classic steelhead pattern. Hang on. It's just a tank thread. Work my way down the shank. I'll take a bit of woolly sparkled up. Make a small butt in this line. Then I'd use a feather from a goat and pheasant skin. This is one of the red spay haggles from this bird. I prepare the feather. Double the haggle while winding it. Then I'll take a piece of copper wire for the rip. Put some dubbing on the thread to form the body. Brush it out using a toothbrush. I'm gonna go up with a rip. Take a bunch of hair from a white calf tail. Pull out the shortest fibers. Put a drop of head cement in there to glue these hair ends in place. This will make a much stronger fly. Mm -hmm. 
Then I prepare a feather for the front haggle. This is a Mallard breast feather dyed red. The original pattern calls for red haggle. I think this feather adds a little extra with those dark markings on the front haggle. Besides, these fibers add to the spay-like appearance of this fly. I'll build up a head. And make a whip finish. Coat the head with UV glue or UV resin. Ordinary fly tying lacquer would do just as well. Just needs more coats. That's it. Okay guys, that's all for today. The polar shrimp ready for fishing. Thanks for watching. <laughs>